Hey y'all, Tammy here with Happy Art Creations and welcome to my today. I'm so glad you're here with me. It's been a lot going on and life is good and so anyhow today it's geranium. So I'm working on a commission for a trivet um, and so I want to go over a few of my colors and what I've done already. And I got a new little thing I've worked up in here, and if it works, I'll tell you about it. If not, we'll just keep it at that until I devise something more, okay? So the colors I've used today, Lord have mercy, I can't see a thing. Let's see. Where are my glasses? Okay. All I'm going to say is please forgive me ahead of time. This one's from Hippie, and it is wine, okay? This one here is, oh, what is this? Um, uh, light, pure red by Hippie Micas. This one here is scarlet. Okay, these are all pigments. Now, in the one that has the wine, I added some Carmen Red and just some Primary Red. I wanted to deepen it up a little bit, but bring it brighter. But I like what the... Um, uh, the wine did to it, okay? It has a real pretty. Um, these have got a lot of bubbles, but I'm going to try it anyhow, y'all. Okay? And I knew there was a reason why I didn't buy these cups. These lids, every time I buy them, they don't fit. They don't go on. So it's aggravating. Okay, anybody know of a good one? Let me know. Um, anyhow, I'm going to use some gold. I'm going to use my white house paint. I'm going to use some white paint. And then my sneaky select. I'm going to try some geraniums. Uh, I was thinking about doing just some pretty little blooms, and we'll see. We'll see how it goes, okay? Um, I don't know. There's just something, something about summer and geraniums. Anybody else feel the same way? That's how I feel. So I hope we can, this goes through. I'm adding just a little bit of water. Okay, because this is a little bit thicker than some of my others, but hey, you know. All right. Do do. Let me get some paper towels. Let's put them right ya. And right ya. All right. I feel like I'm forgetting something. I'm forgetting one thing. Here it is. Okay, so this right here will be resin, and if you can see, I've got some resin stuff right beside me. Let me just move these. We don't need to see them right now, okay? Move them over here, here, and here. See if you can see that up close. See that around the edges? Now, I always tape it, but this is going to be resin also. So what this is, this is latex. Now, if you are allergic to latex, I have to keep telling you, do not use it. It's just liquid latex. I put a teeny bit into a tiny little, uh, like a uh, pill cup, you know, a little med cup or something, and I uh, just rub it around the edges because that's where the doggone, uh, what's it called, is so hard to mess with, the, uh, the resin to get it off. So it's no fun. All right, so let me move these out of the way. Y'all, I literally, where can I put them? Right here. <laughs> I literally have no room. I've got every table filled up. I was going to have that art fair this past weekend, and we had storms, and oh, it was just like I was just crushed. But, you know, there's a reason for everything. So from now on, it's indoor shows. I'm not doing these outdoor shows any longer, okay? Um, uh, I'm not even sure which paint this is. I think it's the Walmart one. I'll be honest with you. I don't remember. Um, I've had a lot going on. Let me get a... But, yeah, this is the Walmart. Because the bear is super thick. So, anyhow, this looks good to me. Okay? So, I'm going to pour this on. I'm thinking I'm going to put a little bit of this gold. I think I want to put something else, too. Let me get it. Be right back. I'm going to turn this off so I can go get it. Hang on. Okay, I'm back. And this here is a moss green couldn't tell you what brand it is because i can't read it don't have my glasses on and my left eye is a little on the goofy side right now so anyhow let's get started i hope you i'm sorry about the the glare i'm working on lights i just you know i just don't know how i'm gonna get it all done at one time but 
life is good. So let's go ahead. This is a six by seven um, hexagon tile. Okay, that's all that is. So let's go ahead and put this on. <laughs> Try not to touch any of my mess over here. I don't want to mess it up. All right, and in that mess, I'm going to add a hair bit of like that of the green. It's probably maybe the only time I use it. Oh, shake up a little bit. A little bit of the Montmartre gold. And then I'm going to spin it. Okay. And that's just going to give it some extra little fun stuff. So let's see. Oh, you know what? I hope that doesn't fly off because there's nothing underneath. Ooh, that looks pretty. <laughs> just the spin. Look at that. Oh, that's gorgeous. I'm going to stop. That's perfect. Alrighty. So, did I get my shirt and my paints, which are right underneath me? All right, got a few bubbles. I'm going to pop them with my little skewer stick if I can find a real pointy one. Here we go. Any other big bubbles? No, nope. because my white paint had stayed pretty good. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to start with this deep red. So on a geranium, they have like five little blooms and little little dealy so I'm not quite sure how it's going to turn out but I'm going to try to make more smaller ones we'll see if it didn't work out you know we'll scrape sometimes that's what it takes is experiment experiment right And afterwards, details, I'm going to do one at a time. Then I'm going to put my light colored one. What did I call that again? It's so pretty. Scarlet, but it does not look like scarlet. See? But I have seen beautiful, beautiful blooms such as this. Or, you know, they have so many shades now of... of uh, geraniums and I love red geraniums in the summertime we're kind of having a wet summer I mean it can't decide to be hot can't decide to be dry you know it's just a little bit goofy that way oopsie okay before I go any further I'm gonna put a drop of gold in the middle just a little here put a little bit at the bottom here and towards the middle you know hey I'm guessing I don't know if I'll even put white unless I maybe put a dot up at the top what do you guys think this is a trial do, do, do. I have no idea how that's going to turn out. <laughs> and then I'm going to put my bright red on top. I think it's called pure red on top of all of that stuff right there. I hope my cell activator works. It's a new. I'm always looking for ways to save money, you know? So that's kind of what I'm doing here. I'm trying to save money. So there's a little. Let's put you up there. And now my cell activator. I will tell you, it's like an indigo and black. That's the colors. Oh! And it just splurted all over my hand. Just a little. But just the right time to put something like that, wipe my brow, and I'll have cell activator all over me, which can happen. I have never been this squished in my office. 
I think I wanted to put a little bit. Do I have a white cell activator? I do. Where is it? Choo, 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 choo. Yeah, it's a, a Pebio. Pebio. White cell activator. Now, this one is made by my old recipe, basically, except I'm using Pebio instead of the Amsterdam. It really doesn't do a whole lot of bubbles, but it adds a little bit, so, or cells. This is definitely thinner, and I hope it reacts well with everything else. Okay, here we go. Let me move my hair. Here we go. Oh, that's not going to work. Hang on. Where is it? Da -da. Right here. Nope, I can tell already. No. Well, oh shoot. <laughs> there we go. It is pretty. It's not what I wanted, though. Okay. Not what I wanted. But it is doing something. There's a little bit of something, but what is it? Who is doing that for me? Just leave it. Hmm, it's very pretty, the colors, but it's definitely to me not a There's my kitty. I don't want to just get rid of it, so, you know. So let me try some of this red again in the middle, in the midst of all that. It may end up being just a pretty bloom. looking pretty. It's kind of mod. So let's just go with it, okay? We'll just keep it as it is and see what happens. So I'm y'all with me on that? Let's do it. Okay, here's my deep. I like the colors in the background, right? One, two, three. Let's try just three this time. I do like that, that right there, super pretty. Okay, and then the, was it the bright brown? It was the light. Ba, 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 ba. It was the light. Ooh, I think I'm just putting too much paint right there. It's a little bit harder. I made this up fresh, you know. I'll put less of my cell activator and I won't put anything in the middle except that this coming time. Let's see. Here is the bright red. I mean, it's pretty, so I mean, what am I going to do? I think she'd still like it. She didn't ask for geraniums. I just, that's what came to my mind. I think it's going to have to be something I practice. All right?
And I'm not getting any, any cells at all. Nothing. Top of that. Probably make it a little pinky, but there are such things. Okay. Not even going to put the white underneath it. Just a dot of this. I wonder if I put just a dot in each. Oh, shoot. I probably shouldn't have done that. Alright. Where'd my little ditty go? Here we go, let's see. No. Nope. Whoa, kind of messed that completely up. So let's just put a dot. See what we can get with playing with it. Now to find my little ditty. Oh, there it is. Do, 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 do. Let's go backwards with it. That's pretty though. I mean, it's a pretty. Let's just continue to do what I did last time. Give it some pretty little swirls. Right? Doesn't look awful. It's kind of pretty. I know I made it bigger, but I'm just working on something. I kind of like that better. Just keep playing. I don't know, it's just a pretty a little deal and it looks like it's in a field of green and I think it's kind of pretty so I'm just gonna go for it. It's not perfect, it's not exactly what I wanted but I'll take it. This is not settling, I just think it's still pretty. So let's just do it like that. Alright? And if it dries nice, hey, I like the color so I'll do one right here in the middle. Not too much. She does like green, and she does like gold, too. So here comes the gold. I like the blue. I really do. Okay, have you all figured out I like it? <laughs> I wish I could talk to you all in real, real time. I'd ask what you've been up to. in that last one. So any white that's coming up is from underneath. Maybe I did put a little bit of white. I honestly don't remember. So 
I'm going to do a touch here at the tips. I mean a dot if it'll let me. These little squeeze bottles, I get them at the Dollar Tree. Three for a dollar. And they are the best stuff ever. No kidding. Okay, here comes, here comes the blue. I'm not done. I mean, I still have to do my little designing. Think she'll like it. I would. <laughs> oh, that's so pretty, and I haven't spun it yet. I'm afraid to spin it. Let's do a little spin. And that is a very light spin. It opens it up a little bit. That's okay. I'm good with this still. That tells me I've got a little bit more room. Wow, I think it's very pretty. I think she'd love this. I'm um, gonna try one here. You know, only doing three little puddles. Um, not using too much paint. You can see the one over there. Let me point to it when I'm done here. This one here, it's a little bit bigger, isn't it? Oops, stuck my finger in white. Okay, I think it's turning out good. I think sometimes, y'all, I'm sorry if I do this, I kind of sometimes start talking softly. And it's um, not intentional. Oh, did I put white in that this time? <laughs> oh, on the... of indigo and it really is a pretty indigo you ready here we go sorry about my big head I know that's a blob I think I can fix it though. Yeah. There we go. It is doing some pretty simple um selling, which I like. one here. One more. And I might put some green, just little green 
things coming around too. Who knows, relief like things gently. Let's do it here. Be careful. Be mindful of what and how much you're putting on and knowing that you still need to spin. And this is a small little substrate or what we're working on. That's what that is. I like that white at the tips. gonna be tiny and the bright red which I like or is it pure red did it say oops come on I'm afraid to get too much and so I don't get much on it and I get too much white dots Tips. And my beautiful blue. What I like is that this blue is not turning it anything purple with these reds. You know what I mean? And the white and all that. Here we go. Let's give it a good try. That's pretty in itself. normally do that and this what I'm doing right here is you know just kind of bring it in but I like the little design around the edges so it's a new thing but I like it and then I can go in and bring it in a little bit more if I want or fine-tune it just a little bring you up with this in just a sec, okay? Oh, this is so pretty. I like these stripes, so I'm going to be real careful. See if I can't do it. Is it stuck? Oh, it's not going to come out if it's not open. Let's see what it looks like when I spin it. A gentle spin. Let's look. Gentle spin. Look. And trying to make stem like you know Ooh. 
What do you think? And this is just a tiny little skewer, so I'm not doing too much. All right. Oopsie. Let's do... Do I need to... A slight spin. Okay. We're going to stop. Let's see if there's anything that might could be pretty up just a hair. Let's bring this thicker one. Trying to bring division now because it kind of when it spreads sometimes it you lose your division what I like about this is just the it's whimsical right okay let's bring it up oh got my knuckles Always wipe your sides or your bottoms. <laughs> Remember that funny joke I did. Don't forget to wipe your bottoms. Okay, y'all, look how pretty. It's just a field of just beautiful blooms blowing around. I might mess around with some of this green stuff, but I kind of like it, y'all. I think it's quite pretty, and if you do too, give me a thumbs up if you would. Share with your friends. Watch it a little bit longer. It's important to Facebook, which makes it kind of important to me. And um, if you're not a subscriber, please join. We have so much fun. I have a new art page, an art share page called Let's Share Happy Art. You're welcome to join. Just to ask if you can, and I will, okay? Um, so anyhow, we have just a few guidelines just to be nice, basically, okay? be kind to one another. Um, always remember here at Happy Art Creations we want to spark some happy in someone else's life and then in their heart. So if you see somebody who needs a smile give them a smile. If you're able give them a hug. Some people you're the only one that can so go for it okay. Alright y'all you spark happy in my heart every time I'm with you. So I appreciate you being here. Thank you for all you do and I'll see you next time here on Happy Art Creations. Toodaloo! Bye now. Goodbye. Bye now.